finally come. All right, and we should be back for another episode. Welcome hey back, everybody. We're back. We're not black, but uh, not well, yet. I don't know. C sharp could be black. I don't know. C sharp. No. I don't know. Anyway, let's talk about something else now. Uh -oh. uh, it's Half Life again. Again, yes, Half Life. And although for those watching, it might be you know quite a negotiable amount of time. Also, these guys are being big annoying. Also, that's a tank. We need to go. God, look, making me look at you, be hopping. You're like making me dizzy. <laughs> yeah, and there is a sniper in the alley. I'm gonna get in here. Oh gosh, I think the last time you played is when the last time we recorded. Yeah, it's been a blast, but you know. Yeah. Well, you and uh, you and Hald are are quite too familiar right now. Yeah, well, you know, it's a lot of familiarity because I believe the original Half Life One came as like part of the uh, Quake Two engine. Oh, that makes sense. Yep. All right. <laughs> All right, wrong let, me that guy. He's let me into the storage, buddy. I always liked it when NPCs were just literally just standing there waiting for you to interact yeah. with them. That they don't move or anything. Oh la la, look at this. Oh, look at this. Cue death metal music. Oh my gosh. Yeah, cue the fucking death metal music, everything. You don't pick up the bazooka? Because you already have one, don't you? Yeah, I have one. I just need the ammo. Oh my Although god. Although I guess if I yeah, if I pick it up with one spare bullet, it counts. <laughs> I like I like bazookas that have to have fucking laser pointers on them. I mean come on. Yeah, I mean it's a laser guided. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Sir, excuse it's... me, I am trying to escape. Also, I need to blow up that tank before it blows up me, so Nate Fire spam. in the hole. Whoa. Fire in the hole. Oh my god. That guy just jibbed. <laughs> He just jibbed all over your face, man. All right. Now, does this does this game uh, are you able to use like your Counter Strike strats to play this game? Uh, not particularly because they're quite <laughs> different games. Also, I need to get rid of that sniper. Enjoy grenade, buddy. Oh my God, he took care of. He was just like humping in the in the window. That was weird. <sighs> Is he still alive? No way, he's still alive. No. He ain't alive. No. I mean, unless he, unless he's a kitty cat. Boom! <laughs> Boom! Headshot! Your uh, revolver gun, like the skin of it, looks weird. Doesn't well, I mean, it's like... it's an old model. I mean, I'm saying like it looks more cartoony than like the assault rifle. I don't know. Oh yeah. Also, balls. we have this, an alien weapon. Nice. Into it's which, yes, you shove your hand like a prostate exam. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, Turok 2 had this thing called the Cerebral Core. Also, attack, attack your sir, head. please. <laughs> please? Please? Those guys are huge. And they're dealing damage. I'm about to die. Oh, nice. Well, this will be a short run. <laughs> okay, when, that guy when is, is there going to be a game where it's meant for you to die? You know, it's like, oh, I died. Well, I beat the game that way. I think it's mostly just games where it's, you know, lore-based of just roguelikes that allow you to canonically die. So what's Knew this it. helicopter doing? Oh. Okay, <laughs> yes. Hey, yes, man, did fight. you pay your mortgage? <laughs> yes, please go. Go, go, go. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, that didn't last long. Dude, the counter-terrorist won. What the fuck? Yeah. Okay, well, there's another guy. Excuse get him, me, sir. Use your Wookie bowcaster. Get him. Oh, god, that's gonna hurt. I mean, I'm on, I'm literally on six health, so I need to watch it. Yeah, you've been uh, you've been watching it too hard lately. Oh, there you go. Now you're at 36 health. Bzz. There we go, 46 health, and I believe there's more dudes spawning. So yeah, get in. Oh, you can't even. Find oh, there you go. You were crouch shooting. That's kind of cool. You can do that. Yeah, I always found it fascinating that, you know, a gold source game actually allows doing props yeah. like this. Dang, not even Halo could do that, and I love Halo 1. Are we clear? My favorite thing in Halo was getting in turrets and stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Oh! Absolutely. Son of a... Son of a... Are we done spawning? That was kind of neat. It was like a little... Oh, no, guess not. 
Yeah, the fucking boost platforms because, you know, you need to have a boost platform and a platformer. Alright, so C-Sharp, how come yep. all these shooter games have to be against aliens? The majority of the time like i think a lot of it has to do thing? that you know a lot of uh, a lot of uh, different parts of media kind of frowned upon the fact that you would be killing human like enemies oh human, yeah i mean it's, yeah. That, that's why a lot of uh, like video games actually in the early days gravitated towards zombies because like they're dead they're not people <gasps> I my, know. I know. Shocking. Was a zombie. <laughs> I know. Shocking. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh, all these games around like the, uh, the 90s and early 2000s were just all about killing aliens. Oh or, shit! Or just monsters in general. And Fucking. That, there's that's a snark nest. Hold on. That's creepy. That's a snark nest. <laughs> Your grenade was having a seizure when you threw it. Yeah, because physics puzzles. <laughs> Are we done spawning puzzles? snarks? Look at them just jamming out. Oh, that was those were yeah. items. You yeah, you can pick them up oh! as weapons. Aw, look how cute he is. He's a little Metroid. Yeah, also look at this. He wants to chop your finger off. <laughs> <laughs> Give me your penis. Anyone? Ladies. <laughs> Ladies? Look, I missed this too. I just missed all these old shooter tropes. You know, the vents, the aliens, the aliens in the vents. Yeah, for, like, a game of that <laughs> age, like, when was this launched, like, 99? Uh, It has yeah. a lot of detail. And I never knew about this game until Half-Life 2 came out. Wow, really? Yeah, I mean, uh, it was... We used to play on PC all the time, I think. Uh -oh. I don't know, it's just one of the... Oh, oh. That's not good. No. Well, it, things were harder to find across the web or or, uh, or games in general. Oh, shit, they're throwing it was, grenades. Like, they're throwing shit mouth. at me. Yeah, throwing oh, words and mouths at you. Yeah, that's not look good. Pretty much once we discovered, oh jeez, maybe, I mean we had gaming magazines and stuff, but yeah, uh, we we did have a, like one popular gaming magazine here in the uh, in the Slavic lands of Lithuania. <laughs> that was like quite popular and electronic gaming monthly was that it no it was like oh. games.lt oh okay and matter of that. fact that is where i had found out about mafia one my god you were alive around then were you like three or four about, i think maybe like five but yes ah. also you need to remember a lot of these games even though they did they may have arrived to the States, like, a couple of years earlier than they did to Lithuania. Because, you know, that country was so much more remote than, you know, the States, yeah. where a lot of the games were domestic. Wow, this guy's a dick. Yeah, that, that was a little annoying, but, you know, you, you learn to accommodate it. Besides, back then, wow. I couldn't. you couldn't even purchase games. On the fucking allowance you could get, because you had no allowance. Hey. <laughs> yeah, and games were more expensive back then. Yeah, that too. Now. That too, absolutely. Yep, that's right. You you got one game for like a whole year, two years, and you played the fuck out of it. But you know what? I kind of like that because uh, you got to really know the entire game in and out. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, that's how I got to know Vice City from the inside out. Oh shit! Yeah, that was. We, we are eventually supposed to play Vice City. Oh, we eventually. will. We will eventually. Hold up, that game. I'm not that fat. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe you're like because of the suit. Like, holy yeah, shit! I didn't realize. I mean, that suit has got like a bunch of tracking devices, doesn't it? <laughs> I wish you found, like, somebody in there hiding. You're like, what the fuck, man? What, just within yeah. the suit? Within the suit's cavity? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, seriously. That would be hilarious, yeah. Alright, let's see if I can actually make my way up. Okay. Yeah, I need to get someone to open this. I'll open it. Beep. Oh, yeah, good shoddy. Luck. Well, I already have shotgun. <laughs> and that's yeah, how you're supposed you to be boost like... up with this. Oh, that was cool. Yeah. Bonk. And now another detail. 
Guess what? Uh-huh. So the military knows we're in here, right? Yeah. Look at this. Uh oh. Wow. Um. <laughs> He's like, hey, someone yeah, else. Yeah, if you knew don't about die, you you will die. Whoa. Yeah, because of massive up. flame cloud. What the fuck? Yeah, I bet you so many people died on that first try going through yeah, it. Yeah, even I fell for it, so I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> so what does he do? Does he have like a just an ex- like a throws a bomb in there or something? Yeah, it's a fucking satchel charge. I have some of these too. Jeez. So he no matter what he always throws one. Yeah, it's scripted. Also, <laughs> scripted head crabs. Death. I haven't seen those head in a crab. while. I know. Dude, they were freaky uh, when you see them in Half-Life 2 in that, like, uh, oh god, like, slums area. Oh yeah, absolutely. That, that part is so cool. God, Half-Life 2 is so good, C-Sharp! We, we so gotta good. play that in co-op when we do this next time. Cause that oh yeah, you, just... you can play it in co-op? Well, not officially, but, you know, God bless the modding community. <laughs> can I be Alex? Well, provided you do get the model, I think it's possible. Oh. Well, not the canonical not Alex, but, you know. <laughs> Gotta channel the get... feminine spirit. <laughs> Can I be Gordon, Gordon Freeman Alex? You know, he's cross-dressing as her. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh, man. Half-Life 2 co-op would be sick. Hello. I have an NPC in the fucking corner. I'll pull my gun out now. I think he was, like, okay, thinking okay. it was us, but, you know, fair. He should always have his gun out. I don't know he how should. he's lived. I don't know how he's lived for so long. What a guy! All right, I believe there was another dude back here. Yep. Oh shit! He loves like Oh a shit! Kind of need that. I kind of need hey, this don't security mind me. guard. Okay, he's dead. Yeah. Security guard doesn't even give a fuck. He's like grenade. Ah, don't worry about it. They yeah, don't worry before. about it. He'll just should I get off. Okay. Now he's just gonna. Ah! <laughs> I thought you left. All right, come with me, buddy. We're going on a grand adventure. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Sam, we're going. Oh, Mr. Frodo. <laughs> yeah, but he needs to open up th- this door for us. He needs to open up. If you killed him, you, you, you would wouldn't get, be able to do it. Yeah, you, you would just fail the... You'd get the game over, essentially. Holy shit. But now... This guy's important. <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> oh my god, it's creepy pasta face. Stack. Yep. <laughs> there is a lot of that. Okay. We are just gonna run away. These levels are giant. sweet, dude. Yeah. You would think that someone who knew what they were doing back then actually designed them. Yeah, this is um, this is why I like Half-Life and, and 2, because the entire campaign, is it's, everything's oh. interconnected. Oh, you fucked up. Yeah, I fucked up. Quick load. <laughs> Yeah, everything's interconnected, like a, like a Dark Souls game, so it's really yeah. cool. Yeah, essentially. Oh, no. Is that a Dark Souls? Okay. Oh. That... No, no, no. We're good. Oh. Oh. Woo. Well, I always... Yeah, I just like games where everything's yeah, absolutely. interconnected in them. You know what? One of my favorite games is it's interconnected, and it's just one giant world. It's Super Mario World. That's a great game. I recommend it. Oh, wow. Who hasn't yeah. played that? What, the one on the SNES? Yep, that's my favorite one. I, I have actually played through it. It's good fun. Alright, well, the passage okay, is open, we're... but now we need... Who puts this up here? That's a good question. First of all, why the hell would you put it up here? Alright, I need... <laughs> I need Whoa, to get this, this moved before he cooks me. Whoa, is that a boss? Yep. Well, that's one of the bosses <laughs> that we fought back in the uh, power oh, power up chapter. Oh shit! You're like using the hammer of dawn. That's from Gears of War. That's pretty sweet. Come on! Fall for the trap already. I, I should. Oh man, I should run through all of Gears of War. I think you can play all the games on PC now. I'm oh sure. my god! Oh shit! He's cooking. <laughs> he came up there with you. He's like, you know what? I'll take the stairs. I won't cheat my way. Yeah. Okay. What he, a nice he, guy. He's being a little annoying though. So. Mm. And I Where need to he? make. And I need to jump that gap. Oh. Oh. He, there he, he is. went Help to the me. sewers. All look right. at that! Look at that! He's just taking the stairs again. What? A, he's so nice. I need to make Uh-oh. that jump. 
Or, okay. alternatively, I can just blow open more gates. Can I just, like... Boom. <laughs> yes, I can RPG fucking... him in the back. You can. Alright. <laughs> Uh, I wonder if anybody watching this is getting dizzy from like all your like strafing. They and probably stuff. are, yeah. Oh, this is a man is that who has him? played Half Life like a bazillion hours. Yeah, and I'm, I'm not even that good. There, there are some sweats who can just finish the game while in fucking being. I'm told they can do it while they're being blindfolded and shit. Although I find that unlikely. <laughs> they're Jedi's. Ah, there we go. That's the ticket. You see, I like things like that where it's multiple uses. Blowing creatures up and blowing the goddamn level up. Yeah, absolutely. Also destructible environments. Not a lot of games had it back then. No. Gotta appreciate Battlefield. it. Battlefield used to do that a lot. Which one? The Bad Company? Uh, I think so. Yeah, that had destructible environments, right? Yeah. Yeah, Bad Company I 1, mean, 2, and eventually, I believe, 3 had destructible environments as well. Wait, there was a Bad Company 3? I thought that didn't exist. No, no, I mean, just Battlefield 3. Oh, oh Battlefield wow. 3. I was like, whoa, you got my hopes up there. That's a threat. My roommate, my roommate loved Bad Company 1 and 2. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Trapped. Nowhere to go. What does he do? We'll find out in the next episode. Next episode. Yep. <laughs> <laughs>